Guys, this is Rusty78609. I just left Cricut Wireless. And what I did was, is I reactivated my Cricut Wireless account because they had a special, special on for $40 for their unlimited plan, which is pretty good. And instead of adding one gigabyte at a time to my track phone or whatever it's called, uh, it's also with... Uh, We can be used with Cricut Wireless. It's an AT&T phone, and, or it's a GSM phone, is that correct? Yeah, I think so. And then Verizon CDMA. But anyway, what I did was <clears throat> I reactivated it, and now I'm testing it with its first video, and I'll just have unlimited data. Well, unlimited data is never unlimited. I mean, you get the same. You get 22 gigabytes on the phone. Uh, I don't have a mobile hotspot feature on this phone. I'm, I'm hoping I don't need it. But I'm only going to use it as a backup when the Verizon phone doesn't have any data signal at all if the AT&T phone does. So I'm out just driving around waiting on a New York pizza that I ordered that will be ready in about 15 or 20 minutes. So I'm just taking a short drive on a, a Reconata Boulevard, I guess, or something. And it's I'm in Las Cruces, New Mexico, of course. But it looked like a pretty drive, so let's do it. And uh, but yeah, uh, you know, whenever you're out camping like I am in a travel trailer, a little 16-foot travel trailer, uh, there are times you know I like to be, have some entertainment, even though I don't like to watch TV. I mean, I'll watch a movie on my smartphone. There's, that doesn't bother me five cents. In fact, I enjoy it. Uh, why? I don't know. Just the way I am, I guess. But. Anyway, so we're just cruising here. I'm going to go left and see where this goes. I don't know why. That's the Oregon Mountains straight ahead of us. Pretty view, isn't it? And this is a fairly new road here, so I'm hoping that... I know this guy's going to turn this way, even though well, he did turn his blinker up. And I'm going to go left and, and drive for a minute. Oh, there's some beautiful homes over there. I should have gone that way. Hmm. Might do that. Let's go up here and turn around. And we'll go look at those stucco and homes again. I like to do that. Anyway, I'm just burning daylight till my pizza's ready, so let's go do it. But whenever you're out traveling around like I am, you know, the only thing that throws you is the lack of predictability. That's what makes you feel lonely and lonesome because the predictability factor is, is, is not there. You don't know where to go to get your favorite pizza or your gasoline or your groceries or whatever and that makes you feel a little off balance. And as long as, if you're like me, and you're changing locations uh, every week or two or three, then it, it never ends. You know, the predictability never ends, or the non-predictability or unpredictability never ends. And uh, so you begin to feel a little off balance, and, uh, and that's all right. You know, then, you, then after a while, you will actually adapt to that feeling takes about a month uh, because I've done this for a long time off and on. Now that's a, this is a beautiful neighborhood we're coming into. I'm not sure how this, I'm, I'm using this this phone and I'm starting to do all my videos in 720p. Why? Because uh, 1080p takes forever to, to upload. There's not that much difference and it uses up all your data. These are some nice homes. Are, these are like patio homes. But yeah, these are really nice and talk about Stucco, I guess that's what you call that. Would you, or, or, or Adobe or whatever, is that the same thing? I don't know, but they, these are pretty. Now this is New Mexico and Arizona homes here. This is really nice. You'll notice no yards, okay? Why? Water, man. They don't want. They don't have the water. They got. They have a water problem in this area. They they, they have, have have it all the time because this is a desert. But it's this is a beautiful place to live. I mean, talk about up on a hill and. Uh, beautiful all the homes are beautiful and you don't have to worry about somebody not taking care of their yard because all they've got in them is cactus and stuff you don't have to water and I think that's genius if I ever had a home that's exactly what I'd do right there without question I'd gravel it in or whatever they've got there and make it uh, so you don't have to care for it or maintain it you know I mean I don't know why we do that we spend millions and billions of dollars on lawnmowers and gasoline and edgers and trimmers and are paying people for yard service and all that crap man just just gravel it in and put you a cactus out there and you're done 
No kidding. I love this view though. We're on the edge of the neighborhood. On the left, there's some more houses. And I'm going to just kind of make a loop around here because this dead ends, I think. Well, it actually doesn't. That's a pretty home right here on the left. There's more gated communities on out there, I guess. Yeah, maybe so. But this is a really pretty home right here. I love that. I mean, that's, that really appeals to me, even though I don't have any money to buy anything like that. Uh, but I would if. Would I live in something like that? Uh, yeah, if I could get like a one bedroom, maybe. But but these are, I guess these are patio homes because they're not very big. They look like they're about uh, anywhere from, excuse me, I'm gonna sneeze. <coughs> That's a New Mexico sneeze. What's in the air? I have no, probably dust. A little gray overcast today. I'm not sure how this video is gonna work out in this lighting, but we're gonna find out because I may want to use it sometime. Yeah, we're at 4266 something. Let's see if it's got a name of the street here. It is, this is 4274 C-E-R-E-S Court. Ceres Court. You know, the town, the name of, you know, the city of Las Cruces, the name in English means many crosses. That's what that means. Crucis, crucis is a cross. Pretty neat, huh? So I'll upload this video later. I mean, I know y'all have seen housing, but we're going to see them again. These are really neat. And I'm shooting all the videos in 720p. I want to see what that comes out like. I want to see what the sound is and so forth. And I want to see how easy it is to upload using Cricut Wireless and uh, all that stuff. And I want to see, see on the other phone I've got, I've got that LG Stylo 2 for some reason. Uh, whenever I try to pull in that link and copy it in the description of my video, that double tapping, it did work for a while, but now I can't get it to do it. I, I, there was a system upgrade, could have done something to it, but I can't get it to work. And I'm hoping it works on this phone. I'm hoping this phone works actually as good as the Verizon phone and if it does at some point I may end up dropping Verizon again going back to Cricket and uh, investing in a, a phone that costs almost a hundred dollars this is one of those subdivisions you could get lost in but Cricket Wireless for me I've always had good uh, service from them and uh, you know, Verizon's okay, but the problem with Verizon is they're so big and they have so many different plans that their poor old representatives, when you call them, they don't know, they don't want to say I don't know, and every conversation they're in there is being recorded, so they're just doing the best they can to provide you with the information that they think is correct. And you can call them three times in a row, and I promise you, you'll probably get three different answers to the same question. Slow down, gate ahead. You know, I drove in a gated community one time in Austin, Texas, a really nice one in Westlake. And you know what happened? The gate shut. <laughs> you know, I got out, I parked near the entrance, and I waited for somebody to go through, and I went right behind them. It took a few minutes for somebody to come. But having said that, uh, this is a this phone that I'm shooting this with is just a plain old LG something, just a, a cheapy, and uh, and and I, I brought my own phone to to uh, Cricket, so there's you know they, no charge for the phone. They charge you a $25 activation fee, and then you have to pay of course for your first month's service. So that's not bad. Actually, I thought it was very fair. They had some free phones, and I looked at a ZTE phone that they had that wasn't too, wasn't bad at all, but it doesn't have a removable battery, and uh, you can't remove the back. And to get the SIM card out and stuff, you got to have you got to have a pair of tweezers, I guess. Boondocking, old Rusty the Boondocker. By golly, we're doing it, guys, one day at a time. How do you eat an elephant? One bite at a time. Now we'll go to the New York place. I'll end the video and then I'll post it later. 
and every the world would be round. I'm not going to do a uh, beer 30 comment call today. Uh, I'm not going to do those probably anymore. I might do one every now and then. I know I mentioned that in comment call this morning, but you know that in the afternoons I kind of chill out a little bit. And if if I think of something, in fact, I'm going to do a video on uh, the uh, Dometic CF18 12 volt refrigerator. Uh, the, you know, explain what it's like. I've owned it for one year now, and uh, I'll do a one year review and let people that are interested in using those uh, know how they work. Now we're going, this place is supposed to be pizza by the slice, but they also make uh, regular pizzas to go. Let's see, I think I turn in here and go right by Cricket Wireless where I was a few hours ago. Then I went to Walmart and did my walking. And I got me some yogurt. And I got my what filled up four water jugs. So the world is round. It says, now yeah, it's an unlimited data plan for 40 bucks a month. You hear me? $40 a month. But of course, it's got the same throttling as uh, the other ones. And I'm going to pull up here and back in because I don't want to have to back out of one of those small spots. But yeah, it's called Pizza. It's New York Pizza Slice House. It's in Las Cruces, and that's where I am right now, near Reconada Boulevard. All I did was do a Google search for the nearest pizza place. That's how thorough I was. But anyway, guys, from uh, Las Cruces, near the pizza place, this is Rusty78609 saying thumbs up, carpe diem, adios, bye bye, buy anything your little heart desires, anytime you want. But if you think about it, use the link to Amazon products in the description of my video. Why? Because I get a small commission and it doesn't cost you a dime. So if you're going to buy something from Amazon anyway, why not? So what else? Uh, drink plenty of water, three or four quarts a day out here for sure. Because it's dry, 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 even when it's, they call it, this is high humidity day and it's about 25%. And I can go back home and do a little, charge my solar because the overcast is lighting up enough we can get a little bit of solar done today. What else? Uh, take deep breaths, breathe in deep, hold it for a few seconds, breathe out slowly, release it, relieve, relieve stress and uh, lower your blood pressure, and that's good for you. What else? Uh, stretch, 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 walk, 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 keep your body in motion, eat good, it's a good deal too. And what else? Stand guard at the door of your mind because what you let in are ingredients. Don't let negative Nancy or negative Ned get in your head, I guarantee you. Well, anyway, let's see how this video works, guys. So anyway, enjoy your day, enjoy your life. Adios.